Mid Michigan. This is NBC 25 News. I wish to board the residents the best and a successful future for Vienna Township. A Vienna Township supervisor resigns amid allegations of habitual drunkenness. Good evening, I'm Kyle Mitchell. Thanks for joining us. City Hughes is off. Tonight, the Vienna Township Board accepted Supervisor Randy Taylor's resignation. Board members say Taylor's excessive use of alcohol prevented him from satisfying his duties. NBC 25's Nikki Zizaza joins us live in Vienna Township. Nikki, what happens next? Cal board members I spoke with after tonight's meeting say they're in search for a new supervisor and they say this is a difficult time, but as elected officials, they have to move forward. I am announcing my resignation immediately. Fighting back tears. Subject to the approval of the board. I'm doing so. Amid mounting pressure to step down. I want to affirmatively state that I do not believe that I am guilty of any of the allegations against me. Vienna Township Supervisor Randy Taylor resigns with nearly a year and a half left in his term, stemming from accusations of excessive use of alcohol. He wasn't around a whole lot or he couldn't make the decision. It made it frustrating for us because we knew there were business needed to be taken care of and, and it just it just didn't happen. Nearly a year ago, trustees began a process to unseat Taylor through a Michigan law from 1954 that could remove an elected official for habitual drunkenness. It was, it was something that unfortunately we needed to do because business wasn't getting taken care of. Um, you know, there was just, um, it, it was action that needed to, to take place. Township trustee Nancy Belil saying ideas about what to do next, now the focus of the troubled board. Um, I think now that Randy has stepped down, it will give us all um, time to step back, take a look at ourselves. And with that, that's it. Thank you all again. And Cal, under Taylor's separation agreement, the township is to pay him $20,000. Taylor is not to sue the township, board members, attorneys, or agents. We did try to speak with Taylor, but he and his attorney declined to comment. Reporting live in Vienna Township, Nikki Zizaza, NBC 25 News. Thank you, Nikki.